What's up guys, Connor Boyke here, founder, CEO of Wrestle Boutique. Uh, today we're back with another video, uh, something really cool and we're really excited to show all you guys. Uh, so we're actually going to be releasing a new wrestling shoe. Uh, so this is going to be a WB 2.5 model. Uh, so this is the same model as the last wrestling shoe that we did with Funky Flicker Boys. And ultimately the reason why we decided to do this same model is because we got amazing feedback on the last shoe. Um, really the best feedback we've gotten on any of our shoes before. Uh, some of the feedback we got was ankle support was amazing. Um, really the overall flexibility and support that it allowed was unlike any shoes that our customers have ever worn before. Uh, also the traction and the flexibility of the shoe was fantastic. Uh, really held up against the mats. Uh, especially with these, some of these newer companies uh, kind of turning over to newer, cheaper plastics for the soles. Uh, our shoe isn't like that, so it's kind of refreshing for some of our customers to even notice this and notice that it provides even better traction. So we were really excited to hear that. Um, and really that's why we decided to do another WB 2.5 versus a 3.0, uh, because there was a lot of people who didn't get the 2.5 that wanted it. Um, the first one that is, the Funky Flicker Boys. So we thought maybe we should try to do another 2.5, different colorway, different color scheme, um, new patterns, and even a different logo, which we'll show you uh, here in a bit. And um, that being said, uh, we're really excited to release this shoe. It's really cool, it's extremely limited, even more limited than the uh, uh, Funky Flicker Boys shoes. Um, but they're awesome, and we know you guys are gonna love them. Uh, so let's go down to the studio and check them out. All right, let's go. All right, so let's get into the shoes themselves. Uh, first, I'll show you guys the uh, actual shoe box that the shoes come in. Uh, so here you can see the top of the box. Uh, right here is uh, really kind of that static box logo to really go with the whole static theme that we have going with the shoe. Uh, really clean looking box. Uh, and then over here, we have the size tag. So as you can see, these are a pair of size eight uh, WB 2.5 static. Uh, so really cool, uh, nice, nice, clean white box. So now let's get into the actual shoes themselves. So here are the WB 2.5 Static. Uh, first of all, just from like a quick look, quick glance, uh, absolutely sick shoe. Uh, I love the overall design uh, and the overall look of the shoe. I think the pattern on the outside is absolutely sick. Uh, so it really kind of has that whole static kind of pattern feel that we are going for. Uh, that being said, this is more of a white uh, and black shoe, so really a color friendly shoe. You can wear them with any color singlet, any of your team's uh, singlets, uh, really anything you can imagine, this shoe will fit well in with it. And then ultimately that's kind of the reason why we took this shoe with that route, uh, because a lot of the shoes we release are um, very bright. Uh, like the last shoe we released was red, white, and blue. And not everybody can wear those kind of shoes, whereas this shoe, this is a shoe that everyone can wear. And we're really excited about that. So let's get in the actual shoe itself. So the first thing you probably notice is the static pattern that we talked about. Uh, this is really lightweight uh, and breathable, so it allows the air to go in and out of the shoe. Uh, it's really cool, really nice on the foot. And the next thing you probably notice is this logo right here. So obviously this is a brand new logo. Uh, we've never actually used this logo before. This is the first product to ever have this logo on it. And I think it's sick. Uh, so as you can see, it makes the WB, but it looks really cool at the same time. Uh, it's really cool. It's definitely eye popping on the mat. So this is the outside of the shoe. Let's go to the front of the shoe. Here we see this. Uh, once again, we have white laces, really clean, fresh look. And then as you can see on the tongue, we have that same WB logo right here. Uh, I like this logo a lot. I'm glad we were able to put it there. I think it really catches, eye popping, it's sick. Inside of the shoe, uh, what you see is what you get here. Pretty cool, pretty clean, you know, I like to keep it nice. Um, yeah, here's the heel of the shoe. Uh, there we go. And we have this piece right here that helps you put your shoe on. You pull this piece back when you're sliding in your ankle. Uh, it's really convenient. It's really cool. Uh, now let's go, let's talk about the bottom part of the shoe actually. Uh, so the bottom part of the shoe is actually a cow suede leather. Um, so this is actually a very premium material. Um, this was the kind of material that were used back in the 80s up until around 2010 I'd say. Um, then wrestling shoes realized, wrestling companies realized they can make more money by using less expensive materials, so they use more of a plastic um, and other different combinations, and ultimately, it's not as good. Um, the material doesn't wear well, 
uh, provides bad traction down here, um, but don't worry, we are providing that cow suede leather. It's amazing, really nice feel, uh, I love it a lot. Um, so yeah, cow suede leather, premium material. Now let's look at the sole of the shoe. In my opinion, the most important part of a wrestling shoe, the sole is what makes a wrestling shoe. So that's what we place the most emphasis on when we are making our shoes. So this is actually the same uh, same style sole that we've used on the path model. It is a split sole, meaning there's two pads. Um, that being said, we use the white colorway, the same colorway we used on the path WB 2.5 Funky Flicker Boys. I think it's really clean and it pops. Um, you don't see a lot of white soles out there. Uh, I actually kind of got this inspiration of using the white sole um, from a pair of samples that David Taylor used to wear when he was at Penn State. And everybody like talked about them, they thought it was crazy cool. So, boom, these are crazy cool. David Taylor, if you're watching this, shout out to you. Um, next, we can see the different bumps on the soles. So we have hundreds of different bumps on the soles, all of these guys over here. Um, and really what these do, they provide 360 degree traction. Uh, so when you're on the mat, you're not, and you don't have to worry about slipping. Uh, if you're going back and forth with the guy, you really have the advantage with the traction here. Really, ultimately, we want to make sure that provide you attraction, uh, provide you with an advantage uh, when you're in a wrestling match, and this is exactly what these are. Uh, so besides the 360 bumps, uh, we also have these three bumps here and this one bump back here, and we call those driver scepters. Uh, so Mike Malacano over at uh, Flow Wrestling is the one who actually came up with the term driver scepters, um, but ultimately what he said about them was right. So it's actually a different texture, uh, different size, and they bulge out a little bit more. And really what these serve as is they serve as that extra um, traction when you're on the mat. So when you're driving forward, these are three guys will help you get that extra advantage, that extra boost of last double through the guy. And then back here, this driver scepter is more for the defensive side. When you're going back and forth with the guy, a guy really strong, pushing you out of bounds, stuff along those lines, this guy is going to be that extra piece of traction that really prevents you from skidding back. Um, so really nice sole. And then we have the two dots here, so even though we went away from the two dot here, we still have it on the sole, which is awesome. The white and black to go with the whole color scheme. So, that being said, this is the uh, WB 2.5 Static. Uh, yeah, they're awesome. Alright, so those were the WB 2.5 Static. Uh, so as you guys can see, they're really cool. Once again, we're extremely pumped to be able to bring these shoes to you guys. We think you guys are going to love them a lot. We know the performance is already great, and we think you guys are really going to enjoy the overall looks of the shoe. Once again, clean looking shoe, really funky. Uh, I think they'll really stand out. Um, so now it's just a little bit more information about them. Uh, so at the time of making this video, we're not sure exactly when we're going to release them. Um, that being said, we will put when we're releasing them on the screen right now. Alright, so as you guys can see when they're releasing, we'll also put when they're releasing uh, in the uh, description below. Furthermore, whenever we are releasing them, we know they're going to be releasing on a Saturday at 1 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, that being said, it is extremely important, I mean extremely important that you guys get on the site to uh, cop these on Saturday at 1 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, so if you're a little bit newer to Wrestle Boutique, uh, one thing about us is all of our products typically sell out in around a minute or so. Uh, you might be wondering why that is. So uh, when we first developed Wrestle Boutique, we wanted to perf we wanted to create more of an exclusive, high quality company uh, versus other mass quantity, mass production brands. Uh, so all of our products are extremely limited. So, for example, the last wrestling sh shoe we released was the WB 2.5, same model as this, but it was the Funky Flicker Boys Edition, so different colorways, it was red, white, and blue. Um, and those shoes actually sold out in 1 minute 30 seconds, right around there. Um, that being said, these shoes are even more limited than those, so we expect these to sell out in around a minute or so. Uh, so really, uh, really quick, so make sure you're on uh, around five minutes early, so around 12.55 Eastern Time. Get familiar with the site, uh, check out and see where the add to cart button's gonna show up. Um, we probably will have a timer on there so you can see like how much time's left. Um, also another really important thing in being able to copy these shoes is being as quick as possible once you add them to your cart. Uh, so with the last release we had a few customers who were a little um, upset because they added them to cart uh, and then when they went to checkout it said they were sold out. 
So the way our website works is uh, it's the first individual to check out, not to add to cart. So a million people can add them to cart, but it's the first so many people that actually check out that get the shoes. So make sure that you're checking out as soon as possible once you add them to cart. Uh, and the quickest way to do that is copy and paste your information, such as your name, address, and credit card number. That's extremely beneficial, and we found that they, people who uh, end up getting the shoes, that's the kind of route they go. Um, so yeah, they're going to be releasing on a Saturday at 1 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, the exact date will be in the description below. Um, they'll be extremely limited, uh, more limited than the last shoes. And that being said, they'll be selling for $185. This is the same price as all the shoes we've ever released. Um, also, they come with Wrestle Boutique stickers, so I'll show you some of those stickers. Um, a lot of people actually really enjoy these stickers. Uh, we see them all over the place. We see individuals who put them on their laptops, uh, individuals who put them on their walls, uh, individuals who put them anywhere. Uh, we've even seen some stick them on the walls at tournaments. Uh, a few years ago at Fargo, there were a few Wrestle Boutique stickers uh, hanging around, which is pretty cool to be able to see that. Uh, and our stickers are really cool. We, we uh, really enjoy being able to give these out. Uh, it's a lot of fun. So, guys, that is all I have today. The WB 2.5 Static. Absolutely amazing shoe. We know you guys are going to love them. Uh, yeah, peace out and stay funky.